Kaylee, and I'm here to interview Mrs. Frisbee from the book, Mrs. Frisbee and the Rats of Nim. Here's a little bit about the book, based on a true story from Mrs. Frisbee, the Rats of Nim, and her four little children. Timmy, Mrs. Frisbee's child, got very, very sick, so the family couldn't move to their summer home, which was which would normally not have been a problem, except for one big issue. Mr. Fitzgibbon's plow would come and destroy their home, so if they didn't move soon, they would be destroyed along with their home. Luckily, the rats of Nim came to the rescue. Hey, look, here comes Mrs. Frisbee now. I'm so glad you were able to join us here today. Now, were you scared when Timmy got sick? Well, I was at first because I had no idea what was going to happen to my family if we couldn't move away from the field. But fortunately, I was able to meet the rats of Nim, who were able to help me with my problem and took me on an amazing adventure. Here's another question I have for you. Did you feel as brave as you acted while you were trying to help save Timmy? I didn't feel brave at all. In fact, I wasn't being brave. I just knew that Timmy would die without my help. So it wasn't bravery that helped me do all of those daring things. It was just, just the thought of poor Oh, yes. I know you had to have been upset when the rats of him moved, but could you put your feelings in your own words? Oh, of course. The rats of Nim were my best friends, and having, and them having the relationship with my husband, Jonathan, was so touching to me. So when they told me they were moving, it was heartbreaking. But inside, I was happy for the rats because their plan to be more independent worked for them. And now they could be free and not have any worries against farmers or anything. Thank you so much for joining us, Mrs. Frisbee. Goodbye. Bye.